Hello, Adrian back with part number six of Resident Evil 2. And if you saw my last part, Brian Irons just got attacked by some monster with a eye for an arm. What that? Whatever, anyways, we're gonna find out. Kinda remind me of Alien. <laughs> <laughs> so you've made it this far. Not bad, girl. I'm not letting anyone leave my town. Everyone's gonna die. Calm down, Chief. What happened? Shut up! You couldn't possibly understand what's happened. Those monsters from Umbrella have destroyed my beautiful town. How could they do that to me after everything I've done for them? So it's true. You have been working with Umbrella. Then you must know about the G-Virus. What is it? Tell me! If you must know, it's the agent that can turn humans into the ultimate bioweapons. Superior to the T-Virus in every way. Dr. William Birkin is the genius behind the project. William Birkin? I'm sure you've already seen his little girl running around here somewhere. Sherry. Isn't it? In case you haven't already figured it out, the monster that's been tearing my precinct apart is yet another product of the G-Virus. The ultimate bio weapon. Umbrella must be trying to cover its tracks. But if I have to go, I'm going to take you with Why me. Why her? Oh, I just... Can't take the pain. Yes. Now that's disgusting. Anyways, before I go down there, let me show you guys something. Show you how crazy the chief is. Look at all this shit. Chloroform. Look at all the skulls and spots. Look at that crap. It's terrible. Disturbing stuff indeed. It's ridiculous. Oh, I got more acid rounds. Yeah, let's go down here. Chief is a nutcase. He got what was coming from to him. But then I have to kill this damn thing. Sit for him. That was a piss easy boss, folks. Acid rounds are your best friend in this game. Yeah, we found out that Sherry's father um, was creator of the G of the G virus, and works for Umbrella. Same thing with her mother. Crazy. Claire, that was one sad back. family. I can't believe the man who developed the G virus is actually her father. Believe it. 
What's wrong, Claire? It's nothing. But I think I found a way out of here. We should be able to find some place safe if we can just make it out of town. But... Don't worry, I'll protect you. I promise. But you have to make sure you don't leave my side. Leon, are you still there? We're leaving. Are you crazy? The streets are still crawling with zombies. It'll be all right, trust me. We found a way to the sewer. Follow us later. Claire! Claire! Wait, wait! <laughs> Damn. Leon gets no respect as usual. Look, because he's actually probably the most popular Resident Evil character. Correct me if I'm wrong. Probably him and Jill. Oh, I can't leave. That's right, I forgot to mention that. Can't run too far because Sherry will stop running and go in the fetal position because she can't catch up. I forgot to mention that. Well, she could have cleaned it up before she came in, but whatever. Come on, let's get out of here. Here we go again. I guess it's not that bad. These fucking roaches. Get off me. Is that the wolf metal? She's dead. Okay, she's not dead. Oh shit.
Uh, you'll find out what she did, what um, he did, in a little bit. And she was staring there the whole time, didn't bother doing anything until afterwards. <laughs> but she could at least advance into that door. I don't know. Too, not bad. Um, Sir Manager Facts. These are lists of uh, connected facility on the first and third Wednesdays of the month. Angela Bar Margaret, well, Chief of Chief of Baitness, will make us the facility. But make use of the facility. Be sure to reduce it. Let's get the bow bolts. It's okay, that zombie. That's what I meant to do. <laughs> there it is. That was super mega weed. Let's keep running. Those spires are poisonous. Just keep running now. You should be okay.
keep running. Who are you? Hmm. I see. Another spy sent by Umbrella, right? Let me guess. You're here to steal my husband's G-Virus, aren't you? You are delicious, I'll give you that. Husband? Then you must be Annette. Sherry's mother? What? Sherry's wandering around alone in the sewers. You have to help me find her. That's impossible. I told her to go to the police station. What's she doing here? William will be after her. William? That's right. The creature that's been causing all this destruction is none other than my own husband. As a result of his virus-induced transmutation, William should have lost any prior memories he had as a human by now. I tried to save him, but I'm afraid it's already too late. But... And that's not even the entire story. Every G-Virus bioweapon, including William, has the ability to implant embryos into other life forms. That's why he's after Sherry. What are you trying to say? The bodies of individuals with non-related genetic coding are likely to reject the embryo. But since Sherry is his daughter, that possibility is non-existent. It's an inherent survival instinct. It's Sherry. You go that way. So yeah, they came in, they tried to take the virus. He, Sherry's father rejected himself with the um, T virus, I mean the G virus. And now he's a nutcase. <laughs> Flame rounds, and now let's combine these. And now we have to do it out with a giant alligator. Do that. I was at that button to get the gas tank out. I'll grab the gas tank and shoot the gas tank and kaboom. You can use flame rounds too. If you use flame rounds, you're actually able to get some um, extra ammo if you beat the boss. 
We'll use any rounds you want to, but I think it's weak as the flame rounds or acid rounds. Anyways. Come on, wake up, Sherry. Yeesh. It hurts. Don't worry. You'll be fine. Come on. Let's go. Pepto-Bismol will take care of that. Room for one more. <laughs> the corpse of a cerebate this worker. And there's something here you can read too. Crazy. Oh yeah, damn it. There's something else too I can get. No.
All right. Damn, she runs slow. <laughs> Talking about Sherry. This way. Keep running. Just... Use the wolf metal and the eagle metal, and you should be good. Let's go inside the trail. Alright, this will actually do it for part number six. Am I on? Yeah, part six. Stay tuned for part number seven, folks.